morning everyone you join me on a friday morning now it is very cold it's very dull and it's just not looking too happy for itself we're in the ej9 now since last video we haven't done that much to be fair we've been on another track day since then if you haven't checked that out uh, go check out the last video that i made on the channel um, we actually went out in a drift bar as well which was absolutely insane so go check that out if you already have them now Today, we're in the EJ9 on the way to Sourceworks. For those of you that watched the video when we first ever started with this car, you know that the back box baffles actually fell out. The, the back box was completely like corroded. It was pretty knackered. In that, we tried to put my old EP3 back box onto this car, but it didn't end up marrying up. It didn't fit, so we're on the way to Sourceworks today in the EJ9 to uh, get a full system that's track friendly uh, installed on the car so we've got a couple of options as to how we want the exhaust now i think that we should go for a center exit cut the bumper up a little bit and have the exhaust coming out the middle uh, a few people on instagram have said that they want a side exit i think we should just get the car on the ramp uh, and kind of just go from there see what we want after that i've just took a wrong turn in and i'm fogging up get the car on the ramp and kind of make the decision from there whichever's easiest to do uh, etc now i just want to give a big thank you to sourceworks for booking us in today they're really sorting us out with this system uh, the car at the minute it sounds okay on the road but when you're inside the car driving it it just sounds awful as you can hear uh, so yeah i'm gonna uh, we've got about half an hour left to go and uh, then i'll just pick the camera up when we get there I think it would be rude not to. <laughs> we finally made it. So on the way here, I realized the wipers don't work. So literally the screen fogged up, the heating doesn't work. Um, I couldn't really see much, but we made it down to Sourceworks. James is on his way now. There she goes up on the ramp for the first time ever. I'm not looking forward to seeing underneath this though. So, so far, well, without, without Gary out, because the back box pretty much fell off. <laughs> so, do you know what? It's not as bad as I thought it would be under here. It's not that bad. <laughs> Fucking shed. Okay, so the uh, original system's off. That's actually an aftermarket um, cat as well. So someone has messed around with this car beforehand. But um, I wanted the exhaust coming out here. But just for tracks, track regulations or whatever, we're just going to have a big four inch tip like the EP3 was coming out the back. So we're uh, going to let Gary crack on. Right, let's choose a tip. Yeah, sound. <laughs> I'm not running that. Lad, fucking put it on. No. He said chav. He said chav. You want chav? You've got chav. No. Uh, that time again, innit? I don't know. I don't know. I'm stuck. Obviously, Gary can. Uh, it can cut the bumper, so obviously the, the exhaust tip marries up or whatever. No, can you not reach that, lad? <laughs> uh, yeah, it can cut the bumper, so whichever tip we do go for, uh, it can make it work, but we're just not sure what tip yet, so um, we'll see, we'll see. All right, we're back at Sourceworks now. We just nipped out to get a car park for uh, James's brother, but I've given the, I took the key with me, so we couldn't, talk, we couldn't start the car, but he's going to drop it now. The, back, the centre section is on, that's done. Uh, he's going to sort the back box out now, but he's going to turn the car on and see uh, what it sounds like, just so he knows what to what to do with the back box. So we'll find out. <laughs> Jesus Christ! <laughs> That's bloody loud. It pops and everything. <laughs> he shits himself. So what are you thinking then? Put a box. I mean, it needs a fairly big box on it. I was going to say box at the back. This is where I needed to start. Yeah, of course. To... Yeah, because if you'd if you'd have just slapped a pipe on then, it'd yeah. have been a bit loud, wouldn't it? <laughs> but no, it's looking uh, looking really tidy under there. So 
so Gary's just finishing off the exhaust. Uh, just he's, he's going to show us this other car that he's got in his unit. They're doing a little golf build, so he's just going to go show us that. Look at this, man. <laughs> Proper little secret location here. This is going to be a map. Oh, cool. We're going to all ask him now, VR6 twin turbos one. What's he? Is it Datsun? Yeah. Yeah, Datsun. EJ's failed if no one wants it. <laughs> That's cool, that. That's really cool. Look at that, man. Some sick little cars in here. Got a little Robin down there. Something out of Mad Max, this. <laughs> Get the air filter. Sick. Here he is now, Gary on it, once again. <laughs> that looks really good, that mate. That looks really good. <laughs> She's coming together bit by bit. Now obviously, as you know, this is a track car, so if you do think it's chavy, it is, it you're is. right, you're spot on. <laughs> but um, it is coming together. We're gonna try and sort out a cage very soon with uh, SW Motorsport. So uh, they're going to help us out, get a few bits done. I think we want to drill some holes in it in the bumper and that. We are trying to source an engine. The one that we did find uh, ended up being a lot of work. It needed a lot of doing before it could actually go in. So I think we're going to spend a little bit more money on an engine that can drop straight in. Uh, just makes everyone's life a lot easier, especially if we're going to give it a go ourselves. No, I just really want to give a big shout out to Zorseworks, Gary, the guys down here. Thank you so much for helping us out today. Um, if you do want any work doing by these, they do send all their exhausts out. Um, absolute amazing work down here. They've got all the jigs for pretty much any car. Um, as you can see, they've literally got everything. So if you do need anything doing, then check the links in the description, take you to Zorseworks page, and uh, it'll sort you out from there. Is she done? Yes. She's done? I'll send it up. She's done? <laughs> she looks quite good on there, actually. <laughs> oh, it's like a brand new car. See what I mean about the top work? Looks amazing, man. Just now I need to see how loud it is, but if it is if it is really obnoxiously loud for track, then uh, Gary said he'll be able to sort us out, silencing it down a bit. But let's uh, let's find out. Let's find out. To be fair, I thought it would be a lot louder than that, but it's not, so it's kind of perfect. I think we should be fine on any track with that, so uh, it's not too loud, is it? It's not It's not stupid. No, it'll go a bit quieter as it beds in. Yeah, it'll bed in as well. It'll go a bit deeper and... Uh... But looks amazing and sounds amazing, like always. <laughs> Decatted or something. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah. Because obviously it's got oil in pipe and that from. That's that. That does sound good. That. It's about a massive flame then. <laughs> <laughs> 